You know, I've always been a storyteller ever since I was a little kid. My mom still jokes about how I would kind of trail her around the house telling her these grandiose tales that I'd made up. And I think that's really where it started that far back. I really felt like that was my thing, is to write, to be an author, to tell stories. My first book was a short story collection, which came out in 2014. And since then, I've written four novels. This is my fourth one, Pride of Eden, which just came out in March. And it's set on an exotic wildlife sanctuary south of Savannah called Little Eden. And the main character, Malaya, is a female army veteran and former anti-poaching ranger. And she comes back from South Africa to work at Little Eaton, which is run by this kind of eccentric former racehorse jockey, Ants Caulfield. And as Malaya is working there, she starts to realize that many of the animals, particularly the big cats, lions and tigers and such, may not have come to the sanctuary quite by legal means. And in fact, ants might be taking the concept of animal rescue quite literally. And so she starts kind of unraveling that mystery as she works at Little Eden, uh, the wildlife sanctuary. So right now, a lot of people are kind of stuck at home uh, during the lockdown situation. And they're doing a lot of reading. And at the same time, I think a lot of people are thinking that maybe they want to write that they've been sitting on this book idea or they have a few chapters tucked away somewhere and maybe this is the time to really work on it. So my recommendation is to really focus on getting your story finished first. Tackle one big problem at a time. You know, if you're thinking so much about how you're going to get it published and where it's going to be published and all of that, it's going to make it much harder to just finish the story to finish the book. So I think concentrate on the story itself, writing what you want to write. And then when you have something that you can potentially put out there, show people, start to find some people to, you know, to read it, to give you feedback and those kinds of things. So I wouldn't get too stuck on the questions of where it's going to be published and how it's going to be published when especially you're writing your first one. I would concentrate on writing what you want to write, staying true to your story, writing it in the best way possible and getting it done because that's the first big challenge and then take it from there in the end you just have to write it you know i mean that is the first and most important thing is to um get those 200 or 300 pages down and it's a sentence by sentence thing it doesn't happen in one night it doesn't happen in one week it doesn't happen usually in one month but you just stick with it and when you look back you'll remember that process with a lot of fondness I think because it is a magical time when you're really deep in the writing. Don't worry about it too much where it's going to be published, how it's going to be published. So don't give up, stick with it, and I look forward to reading your books one day.